What's up YouTube? Kurt Nelson here, just talking about swinging down versus swinging up. Uh, the new age, new generation of coaches and hitters, you know, everyone wants to hit the ball in the air. And I'm not going to ever argue against that. I think our best swings are going to be hitting the ball in the air efficiently. Now, there's a lot of variables on, you know, when we look at types of hitters, what they're thinking versus what's actually happening. We're seeing a lot of hitters that are being taught to swing up too much and doing it with their weight over their backside and their attacking ball that's such an incredible angle upwards that every line drive they're hitting has topspin. Um, and when they do get the ball in the air with backspin, it's usually going to be straight up. Um, higher velocity, you know, tons of miss underneath. You know, so I said, I said this a while ago where there's a lot of hitters that are going to benefit from thinking swing down to mean in the middle. And I think that's always kind of what we're looking for is what extreme are you on? And, and maybe 15 years ago, there was a lot of chop, you know, swing down to the ball that was getting taught and it was over -taught. And so you had a lot of steep hitters, a lot of guys pounding the ball on the ground on sinkers down, you know, the game over corrects. And then all of a sudden everyone was trying to hit the ball in the air, swing up too much. And next thing you know, what is everyone doing in Major League Baseball? Well, they're trading for guys that throw rise balls up in the zone, right? So now everyone's looping underneath. You know, the complete hitters, the best guys can do both. They can hit the sinker in the air, and they can stay above the, the high fastball um, that's a strike for, to a certain degree, right? So, you know, there's too many guys. Mike Trout, Trevor Jones, Paul Goldschmidt, Barry Bonds, um, Nelson Cruz that are consistently saying, that I swing down on the ball. I feel on top of the ball. Now, when you watch their swings in game, their barrels are not making contact on the way down. It's not happening, right? Their barrels are getting on plane and working through plane. That's, that's the nature of the beast of what's actually happening, maybe versus what thoughts are creating that. You know, so when we're generating swings to hit the ball in the air, we shouldn't have to try to hit the ball in the air, right? Now, if I have someone that's super choppy and swinging down, yeah, sure. They need to work on hitting fly balls. They need to work on hitting the ball in the air. But, I mean, it's 90-10 now. I mean, it's 95-5. It's There's a vast majority of hitters coming in that are too uphill, whether it's out of balance, whether it's a bad approach, um, or, or multiple factors. We have to figure out how do I meet in the middle how do I get my barrel on plane and through plane efficiently and consistently, right? And for a lot of these hitters that are swinging up too much, when they start to feel like they're swinging down on the ball, they feel choppy, they feel steep. And when you look at it on film, it's not. It's a really, really quality swing. So, you know, it begs the differ of like, what's gonna be the great approach for those guys? And sometimes it's as simple as what part of the ball are you aiming at, right? Are you aiming behind the ball and looping under? Or are you aiming on the inside top half you know, and missing over the top too much, you gotta figure out your miss. But I think at the end of the day, there's way too many hitters that are looping, um, you know, out of balance, stuck back, swinging uphill way too much, that are, are losing out on the ability to backspin a ball that's gonna carry and, and have consistency against better velocity up in the zone. So we gotta meet in the middle somewhere, you know? So those are my thoughts on swing down versus swing up. We can expand on that later, but very important to understand the difference between the two, who you're dealing with versus what they think versus what's actually happening, right? All right, guys, take care.